Good morning everyone, welcome back. Hope you guys like the trailer and today is the day we finally open this special package. So my company sent me this special package a few months ago. It's totally a surprise and delight. I have no idea what's inside, so I'm really excited about unboxing it and share that adventure with you on YouTube live. Before we get to unboxing, let me guess what could be inside. So here are my top 10 guesses. Number one, masks. Number two, sand sanitizer. What? Hand sanitizer. Number three, greeting card. Number four, eye drops. To keep your eyes sharp, bright, make sure you can still see things when you go back to the office. Number five, coffee beans. Number six, Starbucks gift card. Just to keep you even more caffeinated. Number seven, trail mix. Number eight, stuffed toy. I know this is kind of like a wild guess and maybe even a stretch. Some sort of fluffy toy that gives you that emotional comfort that connects you with the company. Possible. Number nine, swags. Number 10, DoorDash gift cards. They might know you're gonna be working from home through the summer and during these exceptionally incredible hot days. Maybe you can use some DoorDash credits to get some iced coffee, boba tea, ice creams to make your summer easier. What I don't think they will have is something perishable. If they send me apples or tomatoes and I have not opened this package for more than three months, I must have got some rotten apples or rotten tomatoes. Such a horrible, horrible hiccup. YouTuber's nightmare, devastating technical issues. The unboxing footages that I shot have absolutely no sound. All my effort was wasted because I cannot receive the package. I cannot fake my reaction again because I already know what's inside. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'll try to salvage this by doing some voiceover and sound effect on the top in real time. And let's see if I, we can make up for that. And who knows, maybe it's more fun to watch. I'm going to watch my footage on my laptop right here. Sound effect right here. Voice over right here. And let's see how that goes. Okay, let's open it. Ready? I'm so ready. What's in it? I don't know what I'm talking about here. Hmm? This, this, this is interesting. So... There's a fancy box. There's a box inside the box. Okay. Something soft. Nothing hard inside gliding. Something fancy, premium, that magnet mechanism, logo up front. Uh, open it this way. <laughs> Still trying to guess and shaking it. Something light. I still don't know what's inside because if you open it this way, you see bubble wraps, bubble wraps. Hey, greeting card. Bam, got one. During these puzzling times, we lean on each piece to get through this together. Ha 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 I was laughing so hard. 
I, I must be really happy. This puzzle, jigsaw pieces. No wonder it says during these puzzling times. Puzzling. Very clever. Blanket. Keep you warm during the summertime. <laughs> Maybe even the winter time. That's pretty much it. I got one right. Greeting card. Alright guys, that is a special delivery. Is it special enough? Honestly, they really don't have to do that. They don't really have to send us anything. But the fact that they do, it's quite heartwarming. I'm a little touched. So what this is doing is to showcase the company culture. After interning at five different places, this is also what I learned about company culture. Company culture is not what they say they are, it's about what they do. The fact that my company sends every employee this special package really showcases that they're really caring, they're really thoughtful, they're really considerate. Surprise and delight are always some really core design values that I have. And it seems like they align with my design values really well. So I'm really glad, really happy they're working at this place. Company culture actually matters if you're looking for internships or jobs because when you join, you are essentially part of the company. You are participating into this culture. So it's not just for designers, but for everybody in general. And each company values and cares about different things. Maybe you can start to think about what do you care? What do you value? And try to find companies with cultures that align with yours. And I think in that way, you'll be much happier and rewarding working there. Hope you guys have fun watching it and get a glimpse of company cultures in Silicon Valley. If so, transcend the like button down below for that awesome blue to show up. If you want to see more videos like this, please consider subscribing to this channel. This will help motivate me so much in producing more high quality content down the road. Have fun following your passion and keep designing a better future. See you on the next video. Cheers!